Good morning and welcome to the tip of the day. I'm Dr. Amy Starr with the Mesa Veterinary Clinic, Paws and Hooves Mole Veterinary Services, and San Francisco Stables. We're helping El Paso help their pets. So you can see I'm defrosting the windows uh, this morning. It's very cold. I just wanted to do a quick video tip on staying warm, uh, keeping your pets warm, keeping them well hydrated and comfortable um, during the cold. So obviously really important, um, you know, make sure that the, that the smaller animals, the dogs and cats and stuff are staying inside. Um, when it gets really cold, it's really important to keep them warm. Um, you know, if we're cold, they're cold, so keep them inside. If they like to be outside during the day, make sure that there is a place where they can get in out of the wind or get in when the, when the sun starts to go down. Um, you know, a garage with a heater or something like that. Um, be careful of fires, obviously. Don't put anything that's gonna be dangerous. Uh, no open flames. You know, remember dogs can move around and bump things over, so um, stay safe. But keep them warm. Put some warm water out for them in the mornings and the evenings. For your farm animals, um, I spent a half an hour yesterday morning defrosting all the waterers for the chickens and stuff and putting nice warm water in there for them to start the day. Same with the, the horses. You don't want to just break the ice and let them drink through the ice. It's cold outside, they're cold, and they don't want to drink ice cold water. So a lot of times we see more colics in the wintertime when the temperature goes down because the horses aren't drinking quite enough um, because they're cold. And so we recommend, um, you know, actually removing all of the ice. So break it, remove it, put a couple of gallons of hot water in there so that you can bring the temperature of the water up a little bit so that they can feel nice and, and comfy and stuff. Um, and make sure you're blanketing your horses. If it's lower than 45 degrees, they should be blanketed. Uh, keep them warm as well. Make sure you've got some type of a shelter protection against the wind or against any moisture and basically stay safe. You know, if you're outside hiking with the dogs or something, put little sweaters or jackets on them, keep them warm. Um, and if you have any questions, let us know. Hope everybody has a great day. Bye-bye.